You may have heard that Einstein's theory of special relativity imposes a cosmic speed limit. Nothing can travel faster than the speed of light. Well, that's wrong. All that Einstein said was that light moves at the same speed in every reference frame. And while this implies that nothing with real mass can move faster than light, it doesn't impose a cosmic speed limit. Because you can break the speed of light in your backyard. All you have to do is point a laser beam at the moon and flick your wrist. The spot of light from the laser beam will travel across the moon's face in about half a millisecond, which means it's traveling at 20 times the speed of light. How is this possible? Well, think about a computer screen. What's the speed limit for pixels on the screen? Zero. Pixels can't move. But if you cleverly arrange a whole bunch of pixels to turn on and off in a special way, you can make an image that appears to move across the screen, even though every pixel stays put. So you've broken the speed of pixels. The laser pointer on the moon is basically the same. Each photon travels to the moon at the speed of light, but the image of a dot that they form on the surface moves 20 times faster. No physical laws are broken because nothing physical is actually traveling faster than light. It's just an image. And as you may have guessed, the red dot of a laser pointer is pretty big by the time it gets to the moon. Depending on your laser, it might be 500 or 1000 kilometers across. So don't worry about blinding any astronauts.